Hey guys, this is Perry Guy 88 and welcome to Let's Play Earthbound. This is episode 85, and this game is brought to you by GameAnyWell.com. Euro. Last episode, uh, Death got from Magican, and now he's extremely godlike now. Yes, and he's all powerful with 800 HP and 600 HP. He has even more than Paula does. Yeah. All right. So anyway, uh, we went to the lawn and bought some brave food, lunches, and jars of delicious sauce, and then we went to summer to buy some super plush bears. Uh, why do we need this? <laughs> You'll find out later. So let's go talk to, uh, uh, talk to him. What are you doing, even doing here? I'm not sure if what will happen, but I said to big trouble ahead of you. I'm going to stay here for a while and help Mr. Saturn. It's important for a man to enjoy doing his duty. <laughs> okay, don't laugh there, Des. That's, 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 the duty stuff was not that funny. Excellent, excellent. Everything proceeded as planned. Dr. Edelutz, Mr. Saturn, and I worked together and finally completed the phase disorder. The purpose of the device is to enable instantaneous travel through space and time. In this prototype, you can only travel to two points within the same time period. It is able, however, to search out the locations of enemies. Right now, it's indicating the presence of enemies in Lost Underworld. Then what's that worker man doing here? I don't even remember his name, George something? Oh, hey there, Dr. Arnonuts. Yaha! The Mr. Saturn's an incredible fool. And the Apple Kid. He is a most exceptional young man. Very different from the kids. Well, anyway, the prototype phase disorder has been stolen. Someone resembling a pig wearing clothes took Mr. Saturn captive and stole the device. Oh, yeah, we know exactly who that is. Okay, I'm not even gonna mention it. Okay! Uh, sorry, sorry. Uh, I'm calm now. Okay, what did you say, dude? Let's go in there, who cares, right? Girl, let's go in. Whoa, okay, something's not right here. Whoa, okay. Oh, oh we're all black and all that hurts. Uh, hmm, it didn't work. One thing is missing. But that one material cannot be normally be found on Earth. The material I'm thinking of came from a meteorite that fell when I was much younger. Have you seen a meteorite anywhere recently? Actually, we have, you know, Ness has. Eureka, that's it. With even just a piece of the meteorite, I can synthesize the material. Sekiyote. What? Don't worry about it. I doubt that your mortal enemy, Sky Gasher or whatever, will allow you to go to own it and get a piece of the meteor, right? By now, own it is in his evil hands. You must go, though. So take every possible precaution. The Mr. Saturns have introduced some of their new developments in their shop. Please, check them out before you leave. I wonder what own is like at this point in time. Okay, wow. What are you talking about, Dr. Internet? Oh, that is fine. We just went there recently. It's perfectly okay. I mean, I don't know what he's talking about. <laughs> okay, let's just go to own it and get to go to the media, right? It's that simple, people. Wow, this is going to be the easiest mission in this game. All right, let's go there now. All right, it's so simple. Okay, uh, let's go to own it, guys. Well, it looks like I overprepared for no reason then, right? <laughs> All right, cool. Yeah, let's go. Whoa, 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 yeah. Oh, what the heck? Oh no, Dr. Anna's is right. Oh, that is taken over by Guy Gas. Oh man, this is bad. Oh no. Okay, alright, let's go um, see if some people are okay before we go out. Yeah, hey, uh, let's check on the mayor, I guess. Maybe he'll know what's going on and when all this stuff happens. Because I swear, we just went here extremely recently. Oh no, 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 it's locked. Kinda, you can't knock. Okay, I don't know how that works. How you're knocking on nothing, but. Yeah, you can't go through any doors. I think you can still go to the hotel for some reason. I think that's a glitch. Who cares, right? Let's, let's we gotta go to get to the meteor, right? Oh no, that diamond thing. Yep, that's one of Guy Gas's aliens. So come on, let's go. We have to get to that meteor right now, guys, before we encounter them. Oh no, let's go to Ness's house. Ness wants to see if his mo mom is okay. Oh whoa, Ness's mom, are you all right? Oh, Ness, you finally showed up. There are creepy, plenty of creepy monsters running around on it now. The townspeople are barricading their doors, afraid to go out. I'm fine, but I'm a bit scared. Everything will be okay if you just sit quietly in the dark. Okay, that's cool then. Are you hungry? Do you want to eat some steak? For once, Ness doesn't actually want to eat steak. That's weird. I agree, it's not good for you to eat too much. Aw, oh, but Ness regrets that decision now. Hey, King, are you okay? Hey, calm down there. At this point, you guys just might be the strongest force in the world, don't you think? We're not asking you to come with us. You just want to know if you're okay. Dang. So, 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 dear. Okay, let's go now. Whoa, okay. Here's one of Guy Cass's aliens. Now we're going to fight them. And 
Okay, word of caution though. These guys are going to be very, very tough. And they're very difficult. Okay, I'll try to tell you why. Alright, this is the Ghost of Starman. He has a 120 120th chance of dropping a, goth, a Goddess Ribbon. Uh, this is from Paula, but that's not important right now. Now, now he will use PSI Starstorm Alpha on his first turn. And then he'll count down to 1, 2, 3. And then he's going to use PSI, PSI Starstorm Omega. So, yep, yeah, he's extremely dangerous. Alright, and then... Okay, yeah, sorry. Yeah, then and then this is the evil eye. He has a 1 in 128 chance of dropping... I mean, a 128 chance of dropping a meteor, right? And uh, he just diamondizes you. That's no big deal. So, uh, yeah, we're gonna have Ness completely destroy these guys because we don't want to have the Starman Super attack at all. I mean, I mean the Ghost of Starman. And, but just in case, Paul's gonna set up a Psychic Shield. Jeff will use some, uh, explosives. I don't remember what Jeff is doing. I'm more concerned about the Storm Ghost of Starman. I'm, I'm just... Oh man, when did this happen though? I swear, we just came to Roman recently, and it was oh, it was perfectly fine. Oh man. Ah. Okay, well that's okay. Because Ness is at this point, Ness is gonna be able to defeat Gygax at this point, and we just need to get the meteor right to go over to where he is. Okay, well, great job, Mecha. Okay. He didn't work on anybody, but... Whoa, okay, it worked out, though. But no big deal. Smash! Sure, I can drop Paula. I wish Ness was doing the smashing, honestly, but who cares, right? Okay, uh... Yeah, let's... Let's move forward. Okay, come on, let's go, guys. Oh, what, more aliens? Oh, you gotta get kidding me. And we're gonna fight three of them. That's even more wonderful. Okay, yeah, you have these guys again. Okay, this is the mechanical octobot. It has a 1 in 1 to chance of dropping a meteor, right? And, ah, uh, come on, it's just another octobot. It likes to steal your stuff. That's all you need to know. And it also does a weird attack. Like, put up an electric force field or something that doesn't work, hardly work. But I think it paralyzes you or something. I don't remember. Okay, let's set up a second shoot with Paula again. Jeff is gonna use some heavy ball of rockets. Ah, I, I mean, uh, the heavy bazooka. Boy, boy, I don't know. How, I don't know what's wrong with me. I'm, I'm, I'm just so concerned about all this. Oh boy, I, gotta, I guess I have to calm down though because uh, Ness is here and he'll take care of everything. We're here too, you know. Oh yeah, yeah, and Paula and Jeff and Poe as well. Uh oh, I'm sorry, but I, I know you guys aren't godlike, but I guess you're the There we go. Okay, Ness, how about how about this? Don't use that anymore. Just normal attack, okay? Because. Uh, as much PP as you have, you wouldn't want to waste it completely. Yeah, there you go. That Octobot is boom destruction. Okay, that doesn't make sense, but I, again, I don't know. I don't know. I'm not making sense lately. Whoa, we got a meteorite. All oh, right, yeah. I'm not sure if it's from the Octobot or the Evil Eye, but that doesn't matter. Most likely, the Evil Eye. Okay, who, yeah, I don't. I don't really care anymore. Let's keep going. Yeah. Okay, more aliens, that's just great. Okay, yeah, now, now, this one's a lot easier to deal with. But yeah, yeah, it's a good thing we both prepared for a reason, though, <laughs> just in case uh, people who need some uh, health and PP to be recovered. And the bears can take some good damage. They can't be diamondized and all that, so... The enemies will stupidly attack this for some reason. Alright, there we go. Yeah. I would probably get annoyed by all the, the by the incredible number of enemies, but th yeah, this is actually not that bad. <laughs> okay, yeah, more enemies. But this is kinda getting dull, right? Yeah, it, it kinda is though. Oh, and we got a log way to go. Ugh. Oh, here's that mysterious force field attack again that does absolutely nothing. As far as I know, anyway. Yeah, smash! You, Poe used the Sword of Kings to smash the opponents. What do you think that would look like? Like, he hits it like a baseball bat? I don't know how that works, but who cares, right? Yeah. Okay, good, we got a back attack. That makes things easier. 
All right, I think we got enough time to defeat these guys, so let's do that. Yeah, there you go. All right, yeah. Full smashed again, yeah, I like that. Okay, yeah, we're, we don't got enough time to keep going, so let's uh, find a good place to stop. Whoa, okay, let's let's stop here then. Yeah, right here. All right, that's the end of episode 85. Stay tuned for episode 86 when we uh, continue on to go to the meteorite and uh, then return to the uh, Standard Valley to go face Gigas. You're up. This is Bear Guy 8. I'll see you guys later. Are you sure it's a good idea to stop here? Yeah, don't worry about it. Put uh, Ness's godlike down. He'll protect us. Yeah, bye guys.